Hello, welcome back. Last time I got ending number two, and uh, it seems like I might actually be super close to done with this game. I just have three random puzzles on the world that I know about right now. So unless they unlock something, it might just be those three. Problem is, the user mechanic I don't understand. So let's take one more moment. Now, why does that light up in blue? I feel like that means something. Anyway, let's take one more moment to reanalyze these. So now, everything that's given... Oops. Uh, uh, where is my... There's my check answer button. I couldn't find it. So this one is exactly just the opposite. This one... is the opposite of whatever's closest where unspecified. I'm wondering if, like, neighbor count means something? Two white neighbors black. Two white neighbors black. Sorry, three white neighbors black. Or off. Three black neighbors white. Two black neighbors white. Neighbor count. Two black neighbors, one black and one white. One black and nothing else. Actually, that kind of adds up, doesn't it? For everything here, see now this one's weird because it has one white neighbor and one black neighbor. Is that unspecified? Oops. Uh, it is not. Why, why am I not understanding the buttons of this game right now? Okay, well let's see what... Specified neighbor count does for this puzzle over here. I'm not sure I can phrase the rule that I'm guessing at here. Uh, two black neighbors, a white. Two black neighbors and a white neighbor and an unspecified. So this one is actually unspecified. It can be either way. Two white and a black. Specified. Okay, that seems to hold up for this. I'm not sure what to do in the ambiguous case. In the ambiguous ca case over here, way over there, it was... Uh, it was considered specified where there was one black neighbor, one white neighbor. The cell wanted to be off. Okay, so equal numbers of black and white neighbors means off. More white neighbors than black or unspecified means off. More black neighbors than white or unspecified means on. It's a guess, just like everything else has been, but that appears to hold up for this. And yeah, this one in the middle has no neighbors, therefore is unspecified, and is unspecified here. Okay. Have I, have I made a guess that works? So, places where I noted these puzzles exist. Waterfall Cave. And there are two along the path, sort of near the rhombus area. I'm guessing this is not actually the rule, and my guess just happened to sort of line up with uh, everything except that one where it was ambiguous. But let's see how it holds up here. So... If that's the way I think it is, then this is unspecified, so it wouldn't matter. Okay, so first of all, the ones that are specified are those. This would be on, because three black neighbors. This would be off, because two white neighbors. This would be on, because one black neighbor and one unspecified. Two white, therefore off. Two white, therefore off. Two black, therefore on. Is this painting a checkerboard? 
A checkerboard with one unspecified spot. It is a checkerboard and that spot is specified. <laughs> I don't know, it still feels like I'm just kind of blundering through this puzzle. Uh... Without understanding what the rule is, it's just that, like, I draw pretty patterns that kind of sort of almost conform to some made-up rule, and it just sort of works. Can I do it twice more, and then am I done with the game if I do that? I don't know, the neighbor... The specified neighbor's thing seems kind of close to making sense. I can fast travel from here. I want to go to... My note says south of the rhombus zone, therefore that would be... I draw a rhombus, sure. And then I go south. On the road south of the rhombus zone. I This is more east than south. So I probably need to go this way. Here-ish. No, now I'm too far west. Uh, I need to, like, get over this gap before I'm where I want to be. Okay, so can I get around... Hmm. Uh, okay, well, let me find those two panels wherever they were. My notes might be bad and might be telling me the wrong thing, but I know they were along the road somewhere around... somewhere. <laughs> uh, so... I'll find that somewhere and I'll be back when I do. Wait, there they are. Okay. Uh, how do I get there? I've been running around in circles, like, right here. Okay, so it's both south of and above the rhombus zone. That's what was going on. I was down below. Yeah, navigating this world is not the easiest thing. <laughs> so these are the two that I know about. There could be more that I've forgotten or bypassed without realizing it. So the rule was... Here, when ambiguous, this would be off. This would be off, those are off, this would be on, and that would be the answer. It's not. Okay, well this one just had three unoccupied spaces, so that one could be... I have no idea why this is has to be on. Like, that doesn't fit with any mental model I can make up for this. Alright, so for these two. Um, again, I can just binary count here. But I'll try to apply my approach as I had it, which would imply that. That's not it. Let's try flipping the ambiguous ones. That's not it. Okay. Uh, for whatever reason, that's it. Why, though? I don't know. All right, well, Waterfall's done. Big one by the museum place is done. These two that I know about are done. Am I finished? Just give me any, like, little uh, marker next to my save file to know that I'm done. I could go look at the ending again, but I don't think that tells me anything. Well, I'm going to wander the world for a bit, see if there's anything that looks like unresolved business. Look at the ending again, and I guess call it if I feel like I'm done here? This feels weird. I feel like I'm probably missing something big. Let's see if I run into it while wandering. So I'm noticing something here. The, the graves in this binary section are definitely clues of a sort. Off. On. Okay, yes. Yeah, so 1, 1. 1, 0. 0, 1. 0, 0. So this is off, on, on, off. Does that, like, match a clue that's somewhere around here, I wonder? Uh, off, because it's the same. On, because it's different. On, because it's different. Off, because it's the same. But there's no input panel for this. This isn't like a... Hmm. Like, I can make the wisp go poof in places where I'm not specifically inputting something, but I've never really found that to interact with anything around the world. Uh, I don't think there's anything more in here. No, this is the end of the road. Okay, well... <laughs> there are more environmental clues that just don't seem to add up to anything. I mean, these don't have a, uh... 
a corresponding paired thing. Like, maybe it's just... Maybe it's just flavor. Like, the fact that the graves could be interpreted that way, making me wonder if there's more, but there actually isn't. Or maybe this is the sort of thing that's just, like, hidden away so deeply that I'm never gonna find any hint of it. And I'll finish the game with this vague, like, unfinished business feeling without ever knowing the fourth half of it. If that happens, then, you know, that happens. That's just the experience that I have. I'm not gonna go look stuff up or force it or whatever. Uh, the experience I have is the experience I have. This is a dialogue solely between me and Puzzle Creator, with no one else involved. And that's the way I like it. Okay, well, I'm um, wandering a little more, then I'll uh, do the ending again if I find nothing and see if anything's changed there, I guess? Oh, this is bothersome. What the heck are you? What am I looking at here? What am I looking at there? Like, what is... That's a door. That's a closed door. That's something I can theoretically open somehow. Hold on, this looks extremely much like unfinished business. I should not walk away from this door. Do I need to power up this spot and then that door will open? Let's bring power over here. Okay, how would I do that? Gotta get to the other side, I think. Alright, so other side. N no, I need a side I can access that from. <laughs> right, okay. Uh, which side is that? Here, but how do I... Okay, we got a navigation puzzle here. Hang on, there was like a little stairway up this direction. Or I could get down there. And go somewhere, maybe. What does this do? Here we go. Okay, access. Uh, access. It's really hard for me to tell, like, what's interior, what's exterior, where the... Where the walls are and are not. Okay, right. So each of these is a power station that I can chain from to, uh continue the line, but I really just got to get from here to here, maybe? So to do that, uh, let's start with this. Actually, now, hold on. So this is here. That has two. I'm going to do this. Just trying to remember how this part of the puzzle works. Should be fine. I'll move you over, let's say, here. That's not a good spot. Here. And then... The, hmm. I guess what I'll have to do is this and then this. Is this accomplishing anything? I think it is, eventually. Just a matter of kind of taking my bridges with me. So, I go... Do I know what these symbols here are? I'm not certain that I do. This one's lit up in blue. That's not the same pattern that was on the door there, but it is 3x3. Three three. I don't know. I don't know what I'm looking at here. Anyway, um... Wait. Hello, you are white. You're white. You're Hold on, there's a solution here. No, that lit it up. Wait, what? What am I seeing? Is this nothing? Do those just like unlight? 
No, that unlit. It's unhappy when it... You unlit. Uh-oh. Feels like there's a meta puzzle here of some sort. Well, okay, one meta puzzle at a time. I, it's not even clear enough that there is actually something here. There might not be. It might just be chasing after something that doesn't actually exist, but I'm chasing. Let's see what I can do. Okay. Rotate you around. I'm gonna bring you here. So most of these are pretty unhappy now. Only these two are satisfied and you are... You're lit up now. Why is that? Okay, if I... So I'm going to want this to connect there. Something to connect to that. So I guess I can do... One of those. Um, yeah, this will let me at least do the basic thing I was trying to do. So power... Here. Does nothing for the door. Okay, no, I think this... Maybe that's a key for this little map here. I don't know what these symbols mean, though. This has a line coming up off of it, and it's light blue. This has a line, and it's dark gray. This has no line, and it's blue. What does this mean? So do I want to match that pattern or is that just like this? That's... Did that change since I was last looking at it? Am I changing this with you? So like if I do that... Uh, that did change it. You are... I think this is a door. Somehow it reflects the state of this. Maybe I can ignore the whether these things are lit up or not. Is this just what's powered? No, no, that's not just what's powered. But okay, yeah, so I can see this sideways rocket ship pattern, or Y, or whatever you want to call it, does match those symbols down here. But, like, what's my goal? Do I have one? Alright, what does this do? It lit that. This is lit here but not there. Well, I guess I couldn't see it because the bridge was obstructing it. Okay, so what? What? So I've stumbled on something, like, there's definitely something happening here, but how would I ever tell what it is? I don't think I really have a clear goal state here. Maybe get all of these lit or dark, or, or is this... I don't think these are clues for what I'm doing here. Uh-oh. 
Okay, well... <laughs> I'm gonna mess around here for a while and see if I can make anything happen because... I don't know if I can? I'll attempt to get these all lit up. And see if that means anything, I guess. Oh, well, that's pretty close. So I have all but... I've just, like, shuffled bridges around until things were happy. So all but this one. But if I take this away from here, you will be unhappy, right? Yeah, okay. So... I haven't understood the rules. I'm just moving things around. Like, it's definitely bridge connections. Like, nothing I do up here is going to affect the, the happiness of this block down here. This one, I think, wants to be isolated. This one wants to be isolated. The desired state of... Okay, so what does this one want? Upper left, I have to have to look up here to see the state when it's obscured like that. I still don't know what the... Wait, hold on. You want one... Br yeah, you want to be isolated. You want to be isolated. You want one bridge. You want one bridge. You want one bridge. You want one... You Yeah, okay, so each of these symbols is just saying... That wants one connection. Maybe. You have one connection to this. You have one connection to... Yeah, okay, so it's connection count, probably. Okay, so, this must be isolated, this must be isolated. You want one connection, you want one connection. Therefore, this bridge has to be exactly here. If you want one connection, this bridge has to be exactly here. Wait, could I... Can I do that? No, then you still count as two and you count as zero. Okay, so how can I have only one connection on this bridge, this node that I'm standing on, while fulfilling the rest of those requirements? Well, this has to go... Ah, it would be this. This will solve it. There we go! I did something! Okay! The door opened! I did a thing! That was wild. Will it close again if I do this? It did. Okay, so it's very specific. Okay? This is not at all what I thought I was looking for. Well, isn't it? I solved all the puzzles I knew about. And this is why some of these travel routes exist, maybe. Maybe. So now that's making me think about other... Things. <laughs> Other spots where I can, like, affect the state of the world with uh, the puzzles here. Okay. So, I found some form of bonus zone here. Alright, yeah, that was just an entirely new symbol that I uh, did not know. Okay, so, uh, you're going to be in opposite colors. It looks like I can do this, right? Uh, yes. Alright, so, simple line stuff. You are that kind of flower, therefore, this and this are on. This is valid, this is valid, that's valid, yep, okay. Uh, Alright, so you. When you're off, everything there is valid, but then that makes it impossible to make a good shape with that, so you must be on. Therefore, you want to see all of this. Therefore, that establishes your shape, which is this. Which means I have a problem. That's fine. That would want to be that, but it would overlap with this, which is a problem. Hang on. Let, let's start over and look at this logic again. So you... When you're off, you want to see one adjacent to yourself that is on. And since this is an edge and you're off, you see it as on. So you're satisfied exactly as you are. The most isolation I can do is this. Oh, hang on. Okay, that's the same thing, but better, isn't it? Yeah, because then I get the option of... 
Yes, okay, this is totally coming together. Everything is oriented correctly. Okay, that just, just kind of worked. Okay. So, uh, you could be on. If this were off. Okay, what are these flowers telling me? Too many things. Um, what is this telling me? Okay, this is telling me one adjacent to this must be on. So either this has to be off, or it has to be on and two others around it have to be on. If this were off, then all of these would have to be off. If this were off and this were off, are you compatible? You would need this. Which would mean I'd need this or that. Which doesn't work with you, so instead I would do that. Which would mean I need ye right to this. Okay, you're satisfied. You are satisfied. You need one more on next to you, and it's going to have to be this. And you need to be on? No. I can do that. And... Yeah, that's what I thought. If I do that, then you're no good. If I do this, then that has to be on. This didn't seem to chain to uh, a viable solution. Hold up, can I just leave that off? No, because you need another neighbor that's on. If it's... wait. But... wait, what? Oh, you want to see two more that are on. Of course you do. If I do that, then you're no good. And if I don't do that, then I can't satisfy this, right? And that simultaneously. Okay, so this doesn't resolve. Okay, so where did I go wrong exactly? All right, reset. So this has to be on. What implications does it have for this one? Right, I wasn't sure, so I tried with it off. Let's try with it on. So that means two others next to you need to be on. If I do that, then you're already fully satisfied. If I do this, you don't really care either way. Whether you're on or off, you want two, two neighbors on, two neighbors off, okay? If this is on, then those have to be. If that's the way it is, it's already satisfied. Wait, but something's wrong in here. Ah, uh, you have four on neighbors. Can I satisfy you? Maybe? I think I can. That should resolve? No. Of course, that's too many for you. Would this resolve? Maybe. Oh, whoops, this chained to there now, but I can... Can I add that? Uh, that's not how you do that. Uh, up, right, right, I cannot, but if I add this... Maybe. Okay, is that the same shape? Up, up, left. Up, right, right. Up, down, right. It is the same shape. Okay, and that's why all that space was over there, because that had to be drawn with this. All right, that was fun. Big screen. Okay, we got some uh, stuff going on here. Okay, let me do this. <laughs> I'm going to leave these puzzles for myself for next time. Because otherwise there's going to be a lot of uncertainty. 
I want to leave myself in a state where I either know that I'm done or know that I have puzzles to do. If I solve these puzzles and stop, I won't know either of those things. So I'm going to leave myself with puzzles to do. Next time we'll try these and do another poke around the world and see if there's anything else tucked away like this. Ugh. I wish there were some, like, I wish, like, seeing the credits would have given me a total puzzle count or something, but again, I just have to accept that I'll find what I find, and I found this, and there might be more to find. So I'll do these, I'll do another search next time, and we'll, we'll see what happens. Like I said, this part of the game is going to be weird, and it is. Anyway, next time, these.